Hello and happy, what day is it? I don't even know what day it is. June, June. May 28th. Hey, so today is one of my days off, but it's not really a day off because I actually have two photo shoots booked for today. So we're actually, one photo shoot I'm really excited about because we're actually shooting in my new apartment. Um, just because the lightning in here is a one, it's phenomenal. Um, but I'm super excited because it's like a super relaxed sort of shoot, like super natural makeup, just kind of chill. It's one of my favorite photo shoots to do or some of my favorite shoots to do just because I don't feel like my face is like plastered with makeup because I already wear so much makeup every single day working at Sephora. Um, but right now I'm honestly, I'm chang chang and I'm hanging out in this closet clothes at the moment, hair up in a nice little top knot bun. Um, I'm going to see if I can vlog a little bit of our photo shoot here. Um, I've never met the photographer before, so I don't know, I don't know, I don't want it to be weird or anything. Um, but my second shoot is downtown today. Um, it's in a place called the Exchange District where I live. It's super like hipster, there's graffiti everywhere, it's super chill. I love the vibes there and clothes we're shooting I'm super excited for. Um, just because it's totally my style, it's like New York street style. So we have like oversized denim jackets. I have, sorry this is like a weird angle. Um, some like khaki cargo utility pads. I have a lot of like red tops because I've been really into red lately. So I have like a red tube top, a red off the shoulder top, and then this really cute like crinkly, ruffly red striped crop top. I also have like some distressed high-waisted shorts. Um, and then I have a super cute dress, so it's like just plain black, but then on the sides it kind of like buttons up a little bit. So it is super kind of sporty. Um, but right now I'm just kind of hanging out. My shoot's not for another few hours, so I'm just kind of hanging out at home, getting a few things done, dealing with some... Um, hydro issues and some rent issues, but we finally got those straightened out. Hopefully, fingers crossed. But right now, it's I think it's 12 o'clock. It's noon. Um, I'll keep you updated on how my photo shoot's going. Um, let me know in the comment section if you like these vlogs because I think vlogs are fun. I love to vlog. I feel like it's a lot more fun than me sitting down and filming videos just because I feel like you get to see my day to day life opposed to just here's how I put makeup on. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna hang out for a little bit and then I'll start getting ready and I'll talk to you later. Okay, so I'm finally done getting ready. I just have to drop my bangs. But outfit for shooting, we're doing lace bralette, this t-shirt, these shorts, and this oversized sweater cardigan. And not wearing these shoes, but these are just like my house slippers. They're super cozy. Um, but the photographer's on their way. Um, I honestly don't know if I'm gonna vlog this. I'm very awkward, like excessively awkward. I don't want it to be weird, but, um, yeah, we might vlog it, we might not, but I just wanted to come on here. I got, I'm looking good. Like, I like my makeup. It's super, let's see, like, fresh, dewy, natural. Um, yeah. So, we just wrapped up the first shoot. I didn't vlog it just because it's my first time meeting him, and I didn't want it to be weird or awkward, but I'm definitely going to vlog the next one because of the fact that I know the photographer that I'm shooting with. I've shot with her before. We got some super dope shots. So, selfish, shame, per se, sh sh self, sh what's the word? Some, uh, word vomit. Uh, sh or no, shameless self promo. There we go. Q 
Kiana Karens. Kiana underscore Karens is my Instagram. It'll be linked down below for y'all, but um yeah, I'm super excited with the shots we got. We this is a little bit of like the setup that we have um or had. So we had used my softbox lights to get some nice lighting going on. And made a little bit of a mess, not too bad. But there we go. There we go. I'm just kind of lounging around for until the next shoot. For I cannot talk today. I am lounging around waiting for my next shoot. Um, yeah. I don't. I think we're shooting later tonight, so it's gonna be more of an evening, evening shoot. So I'm excited. So I just finished touching up my makeup for my shoot tonight. So essentially what I did, get some better lighting. I added a little bit of faux freckles, just thought it would be cute. Darker glossy lip. I added a little bit of powder bronzer, just like everything that was more cream. Um, this I wanted to add a little bit more powder, just to kind of get a little bit more sculpt. Added a powder highlight, also added a little bit more of my Marc Jacobs highlighter. Filled in the brows a little bit, um, added a little bit more gold shadow, but essentially right now I'm just about to start um, packing up everything. So these are like the clothes that I am wanting to bring with me. And then I'm still kind of picking out some outfits from in here. I don't know exactly what I want. I'm probably going to bring my Adidas. I will probably bring these guys. These are some of my favorite shoes. I can't really see them, but my sock boots. I love these. These are a staple for me. I also have my thigh highs, but I did that last shoot with China. And then I have a few pairs of shoes down here that I'm kind of wanting to bring, but we'll see. Um, I'm taking everything in my duffel bag, which I need to get out. Like, I am bringing an excessive amount of outfits. Just because I want options, but I'm bringing everything in this thing. This is my weekend bag. My weekender bag. It's from H&M. It was hella cheap. It was like $30. And, yeah, so... That's just what I'm doing at the moment. Nothing too fun, nothing too exciting. But I'm excited for tonight's shoot just because I love shooting in the exchange. I love, I like shooting outdoors. I love shooting with China. She is the queen of lighting. She will make this highlight pop. Um, and she's really good at sunset lighting. So it's kind of when we're shooting. We're shooting at about 6.30, 7 o'clock. So I'll keep you posted. So I have my fit on for tonight. This is not my, maybe not what I'm shooting in, but this is what I'm wearing. So I have oversized vintage Pepsi jacket with a striped cropped roughly top. My cargo pants, which I love. And then my Nike uptempos, I think that's what they're called. I don't remember. These are like some of my favorite shoes. These are also the most expensive pair of shoes that I own. These were like 300, I think. To fifty three hundred dollars. Um, add a little bit of these cute glasses. I think this is a look. Like I'm feeling this outfit. I feel very Instagram batty, vintage. I don't know. I'm feeling myself, and I'm wearing Calvin Klein socks, crew socks, and I don't know. I'm just feeling great about this outfit. That's all I can say. But we are leaving soon, probably like ten minutes. But yeah. Hello guys, it is now the evening time. I didn't vlog because of the fact that I had to transfer buses downtown and as much as I love downtown, it is pretty sketchy and I don't think I would trust myself bringing my camera down there. Um, just because my bag did get stolen, they'd have all my possessions, all the things that I love. Um, car keys, debit cards, my ID, my camera, they'd have it all. So I was like, I'm just going to keep this at home. and. I'm out of breath, but filming was exhausting. The last shoot, it was... Whenever I shoot with China, it's definitely, like, a workout. Same when I shoot with Terry Hoffer, that is also a workout. I'm, like, sweating. But I went and I got myself a Slurpee, because when I walked home, I had my denim jacket on, jeans on, and it's hot outside. Like, it is so hot, so I'm, like... It's surprisingly so good. Um, so right now I'm just gonna crawl into bed. I think 
finish editing up another vlog. Yeah, and that's about it. I am exhausted today. Like, I am... I'm so tired. Like, I'm ready to just take my makeup off, take my clothes off, crawl into bed. Um, I'm just go to bed. This is probably the end of this vlog for today anyways. Um, I'll vlog a little bit tomorrow because it's my birthday and I'm excited. Um, I got some things planned for my birthday, so I'll take you along with me there, but right now I'm just gonna go relax in bed. Good night. Hello, good morning, and happy May 29th. <laughs> it is my birthday today. I'm excited. Um, I look like trash. I literally just woke up and got out of bed like two seconds ago. Um, I literally still have my, my spot treatment on from last night. And then I woke up with this, like, Jesus, you try to curse me or something because, like, really on my birthday. But today, um, I'm going to the spa. I'm excited. I'm going to get a facial and a pedicure. It is much needed. My skin, I feel like, is so congested. Um, even though I take really good care of my skin, I still feel like it needs a little bit of TLC. Some extractions. Also, just like a facial massage, it's so nice. But right now, I'm about to make myself breakfast. I don't know what I'm going to have. I kind of want a cinnamon bun. I have so many cinnamon buns. I made pancakes yesterday. Um, so, I don't know. I have to clean my apartment before I do anything, or before I leave anywhere. I don't want to show you guys too much, because I still want to do an apartment tour once everything is kind of done, so. But yeah, I'm going to go make breakfast. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah, baby, girl, you're so damn fine, though. No. Want to know if I can hear it from behind, though. No. I'm sipping on you like some fine wine, though. No. These are literally like the best things ever. Um, they're just so good. It's not the healthiest of breakfast. But it's my birthday and I can do what I want. I got the clock in my body. 17 shots, no 30. Yeah, she's fine. ice cubes for you so you have to remember to make your own and I never remember to make my own we're not forgetting this time your girl is trying to find a boy it's not working out so well look at the cookies none of these none of these have worked same with tinder this is a different story like, out of all of these, nothing. Oh my god, throw back to this guy. Oh my god. I have deleted and had re-downloaded Tinder so many times. So, I used to have like, it was like 400 matches. Now I only have 362. So, I make iced coffee in the morning. Because who drinks hot coffee? I don't know. Your guys are the devil. She's got class and style. Street knowledge by the time. the point in my morning where I literally just scroll through my Instagram shuffless sh shameless self promo this be my Instagram 
you must go follow. Get me to a thousand. We're getting there. Well, this is one of my Instagram accounts. This is the other one. This one's more makeup, but I tracked hair to modeling, but then I'm just like, ugh, no. Okay, so I'm just about to leave for the spa. Current OOTD. So, I kept it, of course, very casual. What I was going to wear was a nice, like, lace-up t-shirt dress and some sock boots. Uh, then I realized my legs aren't chafing enough, so I was like, well, <laughs> okay. So I'm wearing these high-waisted or higher rise boyfriend denim distressing in the knees shoes we just have just adidas all-stars but with the normal toes instead of like those weird ones yeah if you know what i mean i need a new pair of these so badly mine are getting so beat up i wear these pretty much all the time top is just from forever 21 I have an obsession with construction orange and yellow like super bright colors so this one just says overdressed on the sleeves I love it because it's super comfortable lightweight a little bit of a crop to it and a little bralette um, bag of the t the bag of the day is my Versace black crossbody I love this Versace purse this is like my child I invested so much money into this guy and I was like it's my baby. I am saving up for a Gucci bag and a Gucci belt and a Gucci wallet. So, um, yeah. yeah. But we're just about to leave. I think my mom is bringing me like a few things, but this is just the outfit. Super cash. It's not what I wanted to wear, but it'll work, I guess. Right now, I'm on my way to let Deborah in. It's Deborah. Deborah! It's Deborah! <laughs> Deborah! Hey! <laughs> you want me to bring my stuff in first? Well, yeah, or it's gonna be like no good. Well, give me my. Okay, here's your happy birthday treat. Well, thank for you. The okay, here's the. I just got, because I had this in my fridge. So I gave you one of the mushrooms and the green pepper. And these need to go in the freezer because those are those little thingies you like. And there's the birthday girl heading in with her birthday treats and her milk and her juice and all the other good shit that you get that her mother spoils her with. Yippee I eh? So, I don't know, I thought a hundred bucks. So we just finished up at McDonald's. Eep. Now we're on the way to clean my face. I woke up with this this morning. Oh that my gosh. Really There's a fucking she's, crater. She's big. It's kind of hurt. Hopefully they do the extractions. I love extractions. Take that off or that'll be extracted. <sighs> okay. Okay. Now where's my sunglasses? Fuck Deborah, you're just losing everything. I am today. I'm tired. That's why. Oh. She's always tired. Mm, uh, it's because I do too much. Not enough. I'm always doing shit. No, I didn't leave them on the. No. There they are. I'm supposed to take them off when I get out of the car, but I'm not bright enough. So I just got back from my facial. My skin low key hurts like really low key, it's super red. So we did exfoliation, extractions, mask, serum, you know, the usual, and it's very sensitive, like extremely sensitive at the moment. Um, I actually haven't seen what my skin looks like, so <sighs> let's take a trip, let's see how red my skin is. I get very red very easily. Okay, it's definitely not as bad as I thought it was. Oh wow, super uncongested around these areas. I know she got rid of 
She made quite a few extractions, if you can see, like all over here in my forehead and a lot on my nose. And it actually hurt so bad on the nose. And this one hurt a lot too. And like around the eyes kind of hurt, but it's not too bad. Um, so right now I'm just kind of hanging out at my place. I'm going for a birthday dinner afterwards. Nothing fancy, we're just going for a stir fry. Loki want to dress up, wear something cute, but then Loki don't really want to. Um, but I'm not going out for dinner for another like three hours, so I'm just going to kind of kick it around my place, relax, maybe take a nap. I'm exhausted. Um, this guy over here really freaking hurts. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to take a little bit of a nap. So I was supposed to go out for dinner tonight. And I text my mom, and I'm like, I'm exhausted. Like, I am tired, mentally, physically, emotionally. I have, as far as I know, a minimum of five day, like a five day work week. Um, so, so far I'm gonna be working five days in a row, and I don't have next week's schedule, so I don't know if I'm working. Let's just say, like, I work Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I don't know if I work Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, so it's a minimum of at least five days in a row, and possibly eight or nine and I'm just like I need my sleep I'm tired my face is like it's bright red I do not feel comfortable going out like this to be honest I can't put makeup on my face until tomorrow and like <laughs> I just feel very self-conscious so I am just gonna hang out at home they want to run a nice hot bath um, we'll have a shower and then have a bath because I'm just I'm exhausted. I just need some sleep or a nap and just watch some TV. I'm not feeling 100%. My diet hasn't been good at all by any means. So I'm going to start making out like a meal prep or just a meal plan for the next few days so that way I can eat decently healthy. But yeah, that's what I want to be doing. I'll keep you updated if I do anything exciting for the rest of the night.